you know, I feel so lucky to live where I can look out my front window and see the lake just a couple of miles away. And every once in a while to say to your wife, honey, let's go down and fish a couple hours, see if we can catch anything. And that's exactly what I did this morning. And I'm even more lucky to have a wife that's a true fishing partner. She can back the trailer in the water, she can back the boat off the trailer, and she can pull the boat on the trailer and run the boat at any time while you're out on the lake fishing. Well, as we look out across the lake, there's not much wind, but the forecast is good. So we should have some wind shortly after we get up to the fishing hole. On this trip, Sharon fished one rod and held it in her hand, and I was running the boat, and I don't like to hold the rods in my hand, so I'm fishing with two rods in the racks. Can you believe it? There you go, baby. Oh my goodness, honey. Put a smile in there with it. <laughs> Beautiful fish, baby. Beautiful fish. Click it forward just a little for me, baby. Yeah, click it forward. You have to click it on and off. Boy, this, this is a big white bass. This, this is a big white bass. I'm pretty sure it's a white bass. It's my line. It's kind of jerks. It's my line, too. Yeah, I know, but I can't help it, baby. <laughs> okay, I'm going to shut this thing down a little. It'll sit right here now. You don't have to be in any hurry. I'm gonna get a picture of my guy here on my little lure. Yeah. This is just a normal part of this. Nobody did anything wrong. So what I do is I bite this off. Do this a dozen times a day. In the motor and everything down no. there. No, it's it's all right, I think. Okay, that one's loose. Now then, let's let's reel yours in. All okay. right, Same no one. big deal. No Same big one. deal. No big deal. Get him on top. Raise your rod up. Raise. Is that a Tom? I was afraid of that. That sure was a fighter. <laughs> I don't want that taken. <laughs> I think I got one on. I may have this line into that one. I don't know. What I got. Not very big. I think I got another drum.
you're doing good. Just don't go too far right, because it'll, it'll get shallow in a hurry over there. Another drum. See, and I didn't get any picture of any of that. I'll take it. I'll take it off. I'll get it. You, you watch. I got a fish on. I think. Yeah, I've got one on. It ain't very big. My other lure's messed up, and I think this one's got off. No, down there. Another darn drum. Drum are driving us crazy. Act like it might be a little tiny fish on it. I think I've got it hooked. Is my problem. I think I yeah. That's what I've done. I've hooked my own line. There's a fish on the other one. I've got a mess on my hands. Stop, baby. I knew something strange was going on back there. A little bitty white bass. Turn around, it's hard for me to get pictures of those. Feels like another drum. Another drum. Now, not just real quick, just real slow. Yeah, it's kind of, it's going pretty good right now. I'm not sure, I don't have a fish on the other rod too, either that or, or the line's hitting into this one. I had one, I got one. You got a fish too? Yeah. I'm gonna shut this off then. Let me buy you. I got a white bass. Hey, we got a double. We got a double.
kind of watch the boat. I think he got off. No, he still got him. A little bass, I think. Go right, honey. Go right. It's a huge crappie, honey. Huge. Absolutely huge. Wow. Oh my lord. I the hand too far, but I had to. What a fish. What a fish. It's been on there. Run the boat. 18 foot of water. Huge crappie. Did you make a right choice of lure or what? Yeah. Not having a thermocline to work with this year, the fish are all up and down the water column. So what we do is use a variety of lures at a variety of depths and just kind of take pot luck. So you see all kinds of fish when you're fishing in these kind of situations, but we really like doing it. Well, my gosh, that was pulling hard, and look at it. It's because we were on the turn. Yeah. I'll swear, that fish was pulling really hard, and all it was was a little white bass. Well, okay, he hit right, right in the middle of the turn. Yeah. I got to get it back out in 18 foot of water. We wasted a lot of time in that 15 foot of water. Just hanging, oh, it's a little bitty fish, and it was just hanging in the water just right. A little tiny white bass. Good Lord, it's spinning on top. And I know why he's. He's spinning. All right, it's gonna have a line there. It's not very big, whatever it is. Come on up here, dang you. Look at that. Another little tiny white bass. You're doing good, but ouch. You little twerk. I can't find it. Good show. Good show. Let me get his picture. The boat's going to the left, I think. That 
that by golly i believe that number seven's working on them crappie don't you good show kiddo two big crappie you've caught my you want yours on a bun or you want it just on a plate After Sharon caught that last big crappie, we decided the grass at home was probably dry enough to mow. So we called it a day and we're heading in. We're sure glad you guys came along with us and don't forget to hit that notification bell because we'll have another adventure coming your way soon.